Welcome back. Another great one here. Square root of 90. 90. That's, God, don't you wish that was an 81 or a 100? Wouldn't that be convenient? But no, square root of 90. What does that really mean? Well, I'm going to go ahead and just kind of like draw out a little number line here. I kind of like this. I'm going to pick, I'll start at like 7, 8, 9, and like we'll go up to like 10. That's on the top side. These are our, like our numbers. On the bottom side, though, in fact, let me do the bottom in purple. So the bottom is going to be a number squared. The top is just our numbers. But the bottom is going to be our numbers squared. So 7 squared, 49. 8 squared, 64. 9 squared, 81. 10 squared, 100. So where is 90 in all of this? Well, 90 is kind of snugly hidden right in here, 90-ish. So that means the square root of 90 is going to be hiding between 9 and 10. Or in other terms, the square root of 90 is greater than 9, but it's less than 10. And 90 is like almost dead in the middle between 81 and 100. So like I really think that the square root of 90 is going to be just about exactly between 9 and 10, or like 9.5 is my estimate. Let's go ahead and see. Square root of 90 on my cracked screen. 9.48 or 9.5. Look, you can do the square root of 90 in your head. It's okay if you're off by like a tiny decimal amount, but if you are conceptualizing these numbers and visualizing these numbers, you're like a pretty advanced mathematician. So good job and on to the next.